Hello, everyone. Praise God. Praise God. Go ahead and press tag, press share. I got something to tell you tonight. Praise God. And this is the said the Lord. God is so good. God is so good. I know you've been going through a lot. I know it's been chaos. I know it's been this. I know it's been that. But let me tell you something. God is up to something. God is doing something. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. God is doing something, something. You know, you see something in your hair. Like, what is that? Look like a little boy, some. All right, so praise God, praise God. Go ahead and press share, press tag. I'm going to talk about what I heard God say. I heard God say restitution is coming to the body of Christ. Let me go ahead and tell y'all what restitution means. Restitution means the restoration of something lost or stolen to its proper owner. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. Uh, as a matter of fact, let's go to the second definition. It says recompense for injury or loss. God say, yes, the devil has been wreaking havoc. Yes, things have happened throughout. We're talking about your whole lifetime. Y'all understand restitution is. This ain't just because of because you're a Christian. All your life, whatever the devil so-called stole, God, you don't want that back, but God's going to give you greater. God's going to give you more. Come on, somebody, hallelujah. Now, hold on. We're not talking about just monetary we're not talking about just material but we're talking about as a whole i heard god say restoration restitution and retribution y'all don't hear what i say come on somebody hallelujah you got to get glad about that i don't care what the enemy thinks he's doing in this time this hour this moment i'm telling you what god said yes there's going to be chaos but also god say i'm still going to bless you in the midst of that chaos bless you in the midst of that test bless you in the midst of that trial i feel the power of the holy ghost let me tell you something god is serious Oh, he's God all by himself. Don't worry about how you're going to do it. Don't worry about when you're going to do it. Don't worry about why you're going to do it. Come on, somebody. Just know that he's going to do it. Come on, somebody. Hallelujah. But you got to stand strong in the Lord. A lot of you, 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 you waver. One minute you're in, one minute you're out. And that's because of doubt. You got to hold on to your confidence. You got to hold on to your faith. And you got to know that you are standing on sure ground. You got to know that you know that you know that you know. God, I'll serve you. I'll serve you when I win. I'll serve you when I lose. I'll serve you when they stay. I'll I'll serve you when they go. I'll serve you rich. I'll serve you poor. I'll serve you, God. Hallelujah. Some of y'all, y'all serve God on, on, on just the idea of if you bless me, when you bless me. Uh, 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 uh. Come on, somebody. You have to be in this thing for real, God says. He said, how much do you love him? Don't you know that sometimes when you're praying, you should just tell God, God, I love you. I love you just because, just because. Sometimes, but, but not just, you see, sometimes y'all go into prayer and it's, Y'all just, God, I need this. God, I need that. God, I need it. No, no, no. And I said this tonight on the call. Sometimes you should just talk and worship God and listen. Some of you are not listening. And then you run into apostles and prophets and everybody else trying to figure out what God is saying. If you would just listen, God says, listen. But I'm telling you, I felt that thing in my belly. I heard God say restitution is coming. So praise God, praise God. That's all I got on here to say. I'm a little drained, but praise God. God is good. God is good. You just got to believe it. A lot of you don't believe. You don't believe in the more the power of God. That's because the churches are not showing you the power of God the way they used to. But don't you know that whenever you feel like you don't remember the power oh come on somebody just turn your book to genesis just go through and like watch moses and why you had to watch joseph and why you had to watch watch david oh come on somebody why you had to watch deborah oh come on somebody why you had to watch jesus in the new testament well come on somebody paul and silas god has always been in a blessing business just do you believe he never said you weren't gonna go through nothing but he said you can go through it come on somebody you got to go through it to get to it you got to go through it to get to it hallelujah so god bless you God keep you. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. You, you got to hold on. Be strong. The devil ain't going to just... Sometimes the Bible says the kingdom of God suffer violence and the violent <clears throat> take it by force. I told y'all on this fast, we got a little saying. Back, 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 back. You're too close to me. Hello. So God bless you. This is Apostle Deanna Dixon. Roll out soldiers for that is who you are. <clears throat> Let's get it. Be blessed.